Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to another video with Farmer Nick, episode 7 on Raven or Ravenport. My bad. I always get that mixed, mixed up. My bad. Um, so, yeah, we're uh, going to be demoing out today. As you guys see in the thumbnail, we are demoing a John Deere 8270R today. It's going to be running our grain cart today, and we also got some customer work to do, and we're picking corn, so I thought it would be a great opportunity for us to run this on the grain cart for a bit, get us used to it, see how I like it, and hopefully uh, I can get a VT converted over here shortly, or something, or else we might just turn around and use the old mobile plow to get it out. But next off, we got our 61 35M here. I uh, got rid of the 6R in here that was always here. I says, you know what? I had enough of that tractor. But the nice thing about this is it has your uh, flasher extensions on it. It's got a rotary beacon. It's really good. So I want to keep it. So we are not going to get rid of that track. I got rid of... So let me know if you guys think we should keep that uh, 682... What the heck is it? 8270R. I got to start getting used to saying 8270R because we actually got one in real life, but it's not here yet. It probably won't be here until like January, middle of January, I believe we're supposed to get it. So, yeah, that's what happens, but it isn't going to show up to spring. Uh, the agreement is it's probably going to end up staying at the dealership until spring. Just till the salt gets off the ground and everything. That way it's dry when it comes home, but it's probably going to get brought in the salt, unfortunately. Hopefully it doesn't. So we're going to hog on this uh, cultivator here. Pull this bad boy out. I just like running all these flashing lights. They look a lot really good. I just love running them, you know? It's all right. So we're going to pull this bad boy out for right now. We might use it in a field or two. We'll see how things go. I'm not sure if we're going to get to it today. But we're just going to back this bad boy up over here. Under the tree here for some shade. Out of the way. Let's open this bad boy up, actually. And we'll just leave it sitting here for right now until we need it. But I'm honestly... Since we got that big horsepower tractor, we probably ain't going to get there today. But I'm thinking we're probably going to end up getting this outfit. It's a pretty big outfit. Matthew, one of my buddies, was using it on the server the other night, and I actually kind of liked it. That's only eight, and that's six. Hmm. Anywho, we'll see how things go. Let's see that guy sitting there. Let's go jump in the 8270R. I got that one right this time. <laughs> Just kidding. So if you guys are enjoying the video, smash that like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed, don't forget to turn on post notifications. Yes, this tractor is by Custom Modding, as you guys can see right there. So, let's fire this bad boy up. I honestly literally just got this thing today, so that's pretty cool. Alrighty. I haven't used this tractor at all, honestly. It's like, I literally just bought this thing. Looks really good. Tested it out a little bit. Pulled around a cultivator in a random field. Not on this map for sure, but... And then I was like, you know what? I'm using that tractor. So, we're testing her out. We got duels all around her. It looks like there are... I'd say those are 30-inch duels. We got 30-inch duels on this bad boy. There is only this. There is only, like, this style of wide duels. And then there's... The big, real, the big, big, just single wide ones. So if you guys go on Custom Modding's Facebook page, look up Custom Modding on Facebook, and you guys can get this tractor there. That 6M, I could not remember honestly where I got that guy, but I got it from somewhere. But we already got the combine going over here. And then we're going to go up and do our mission of picking corn up to field 10. I'm gonna accept, I haven't accepted the mission yet. But I thought we'd do a mission today. So the combine's doing pretty good, it looks like it. But the gateway's up here. Looks like truck driver can't drive there. Don't need those bad boys on. Just this tractor is so realistic. Plus FS17, or 19, right? Everything's, the pedals and everything work, I like that. The brake's not working, this thing? 
Let's maybe give her a little throttle. Yeah, I guess the brakes do. I wish the... Ah, it's got this weird... I don't know what you guys call this term, but I hate this style of tractor. How it's got the forward reverse over here, and then it's got... I think that's an A and a B. Um, Dad had one of these on the pipeline, and I did drive it a little bit. I was driving one of these down in full line, or one of the dealerships, and I absolutely hated this thing. What the heck is that switch back over there? Rotary beacon or something? I couldn't tell you. I don't know. We're just going to drive through the corn here, you know, just to keep this guy rolling, unfortunately. But yeah, it's got the big new display screen. Uh, what else has it got in this tractor? Radio. Everything else basically looks the same. Looks like it's got leather seats. Yeah. So that's really cool. Oh, there's actually a seatbelt. They did some pretty good work on that seatbelt. I don't know if this tractor was somewhat similar like this in 17. I never really paid attention, but I just looked and noticed that seatbelt. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So where's this bad boy at? Is it just about full? This is like the perfect track for a grain cart, in my opinion. Let's just bag it up. I hate doing that, but it's the only way to keep it rolling. It's got lots of lights. It's perfect. We're just honestly going to sit right about here for right now. Let's go move some bales while we are waiting. No, I don't want to reset the thing. We're going to use the 6M here today. Um, bale spikes are over here. So tired. There should be a video for you guys every single day of the week now. Because... Yeah, it's just corn harvest and everything is done. So that's nice. Um, I should be making lots of videos off and on when I get a chance. It's just we got that couple hundred acres the customer to plow. That's going to hardly take any time. And honestly, that's like a day. So there might be a video or two that don't have a video up to you guys. I might get some footage of this custom plowing job. It just depends if I can remember my GoPro. Or else I know that I'm going to be going to the field right after as soon as I get out of school. Because basically what's been happening is I do get picked up out of school. Like right at when the school ends. I get picked up at when the school ends. And instead of going on the bus, I get picked up and I head right up to the field. Someone takes me up to the field. And otherwise I would drive myself up there if I could. But you know, I'm not 16 yet. I You have to be 16 in Canada here to get a driver's license. So we're going to get rid of these hay bales quick. Not what I really wanted, but... There's a skid steer there, but I think... Oh, that's cool how it works as you move the... Um, yeah, so... Yeah, let's keep her going here. Um, dang it, that plow's kind of in my way. Uh, let's go in here. Let's give her. Pull this guy out here, and we'll put another row of bales in front of that uh, hay right there. We'll put another bunch right there. That way we can... Uh, that plow's kind of in our way now, too. Gosh darn it putting everything in her way. Or I'm putting stuff in my own way. Kinda sucks. But we could put a third row up, but I really... I don't feel like it's... I feel like it's too high for this shed, plus we're gonna be using the skid steer quite a bit to uh, get bales out. We're just basically gonna be doing that, so... That way we can get the skid steer. I know the skid steer can stack them. Technically, it's three high, but we got the bales turned the other way. And that's all we got left of hay, really. But there is one hay bale up at that uh, cornfield we're up there. So we're going to wait till the helper lets us know that the combine's full over there, and then we'll go worry about him. 
But until then, we're just going to stack these bales, get them dealt with. That way, if it rains, they don't get wet. Because it won't be good. Because the horses, they won't be happy. And let me know if we want cows, because I feel like we should get some sort of animal that does manure. So, if you guys want pigs, cows, let me know. But I'm honestly feel like I'm going for cows. Like, I really want to do a small cow operation here. Just because I feel like it'd fit pretty good in our farm. Uh, we definitely would not put the cow pasture around here because there is no room, hardly. Unless we take fields 19 and put... Uh, it'd be 24, it's the flattest. Or the, yeah, more flat. Um, giants are coming out with a patch that you can create your own road, make your own hills, jumps, and everything for you guys. So that's going to be really nice. They got gravel, make your own laneways. Uh, just follow giants on facebook and you guys can see a lot of it i'm quite sure a lot of people have seen it from now or people are probably going to be making videos on it who only knows but we'll just have to wait and see how things go Shops. wait you guys really like this 6m here i do you know what i really want to see if those um extending flashers are uh hard like is there a collision in them or is it actually just invisible like you can drive through or do they actually I don't think they'll actually bend back on you that'd be really nice let's gonna try this here yeah they're invisible all right I thought so thought I'd check doesn't hurt check Get her up here. We might have to get some grass because I don't really like that. See how the slope, it really slopes off all of a sudden. I can't wait till that texture thing comes out so you can build the ground up and smooth it out. Like you can add gravel, dirt, I don't know what else is in it. I only seen like a few minutes of it on my, when I was at school on lunch break because you only got, I we do have a, I think it's like 35 to 40 minutes, but, you know, I was watching some other videos and messing around Facebook. That's when I found these tractors today. So I was really happy about that, and I was so excited to get home and make some videos with them. That looks good. How's their combine doing? Looks like it's just about done. It's alrighty. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's turn up some mouse sensitivity here. That way the flash or the loader frame will lift quicker for us here. Hey. Might have to get, honestly, we might grab the skid steer for this job. It's going to be a lot much better. We'll have to see how things go. Yeah, this tractor is just too big for doing this. Especially because we don't even have the big bales. So, I'll shut that guy off. We'll leave him for later. Let's run over here and... We'll check in our own, check on our combine over here. So he's still got a fair chunk. What the heck is going on? Looks like he didn't like this spot, so he skipped. What a guy. We're going to park the con, the tractor sitting right here. So that'll be good. Everything's going to fit in the cart. We're actually, why don't we accept that mission right now? I had it already ready. So we want to accept the mission here. Instead of lease it, lease it. You would lease these four pieces of farm equipment or equipment. A tractor, combine, and a cornhead and grain trailer. But anywho, and there's also more fields. There's lots of missions. Let me know if you guys think we should do a video or a day we should just do missions. Do you guys want something maybe like that? We can do a whole bunch of missions, make our neighbors all happy. I think that's a really good idea. Let me know if you guys like that idea too. 
All right, we gotta wait till we unhire the worker here, and then it'll be a lot easier. Then the steering wheel will come down. It's a little messed up, but hey, I found a mod today that it shows you how much your percentage and everything is. It's just I haven't had time to download it, but I did upload it to my dedicated server. So we will have to experiment it. Maybe next video we should have it. I'm hoping. We're gonna unload some of this corn. Because I don't want to be, have to, I want to be able to get all that on the combine hopper here. And it's, then I don't have to run over to the buggy again. Should be enough out of that. Cornhead's getting dirty, but it's, she only is an eight row in this combine. I never washed it up. As soon as she was done picking the beans, I sent her right onto the con, or the corn. It's already did field 26 at the main home farm there. You guys seen that? Oh, I think I knew what it is. There's probably like a big patch or else the planter didn't get planted here because it was uneven or something. Could be a possibility. Turn up here and grab these few corn stalks. Up we come. There we go. Down the hill, over around the mountain, we come. <laughs> you guys probably don't like me singing, you know. I'll just stop singing, how's that? But I, um, I think they might, I hope Giants, or, yeah, Giants come out with a small, an older DLC of John Deere tractors, like your 4440, your, like, 8400, and all that kind of stuff. Even, like, an 8430 articulating tractor, one of those big tractors that'd be really nice get some old combines like a 9510 six row corn head be nice but another thing I hope Giants fixes that header trailer problem that we've been having that's the problem I'm more concerned on right now I wish it would get fixed for the smaller people when they do a smaller operation on their farm but a lot of people don't use header trailers so that's another thing because I'm quite sure that a lot of people don't choose to use header trailers. So let's run this semi up to field 10 quick. Get that guy up there. Won't take long at all. I think we can back it in. I'm quite sure we can back it in that gateway just by using these mirrors. Alrighty. Where's the gate? I don't even know where the heck the gateway is. There it is. Look at that. Perfect. We didn't get her on the first try, but it's pretty good. The mirrors need to be just extended out a little bit more that we can actually see the traffic is the only time you can really see the traffic is in these mirrors is when you turn. That's kind of unfortunate. Lee. So I'm going to get all this equipment and all of this stuff ran up to field 10, and I will talk to you guys when we get there. I'm just pulling up here to field 10. The semi is sitting right there. I got the combine. Grain carrots already trucked up here. Let's get this bad boy picking corn in the dark for the first time. See how good the lights are and everything, and we'll go from there. How are we going to pick this field? I'm not sure how this is all going to work. I was going to get Carson to come and help us here, but you do not own this land or access this land. Did we not accept the mission? Might have not, honestly. Field 10. Look at that. They're going to get her instantly. I guess we must have not have. Must have. Because I had to re. I did put up a multiplayer game because Carson at one point was going to help come in here and help it. Because, um. The time I was hauling stuff up and I had to go. I, must, I thought I must have wait and go get a bite to eat. So that's what I did. And I came back and Carson was online and then he called me and just wanted to know what I was doing. And I told him I was picking corn. If he wanted to come and join me, he could. He's like, yeah, okay. So he was going to join me until, uh. They had to. He had to go, uh. 
get some parts for something. So, I don't know. We're just going to pick away at the corn in the dark here. First time me ever uh, going to be attempting to pick corn in the dark. So, we'll see how this goes. Uh, we'll do a bit of a time lapse in this. So, it's going to take us quite a while here. We're going to be running back and forth between combine and uh, grain cart here. And then we're also going to have to go dump the corn here too. So we're just going to go up and down, you know. Uh, what's this what's this yield here? 1 114. Oh, that's how much you have in the bin. Can't see the average. The joystick or is in the way, so we can't really uh, see what we're yielding. I wish that was a nice way that the screens and everything would work in farm sim that you could actually see the how much you're yielding to the acre like almost like rtk i wish they had something like that set up in farm sim so you could see your high spots of the moist like we don't run at rtk in the real life but i know like millennial farm or how farms work and all that stuff they have rtk and all that stuff so that'd be a nice thing that we would have but i don't know we might get into that in real life i don't think that we're really going to do because we just run our John Deere monitors and stuff and we track all that down from that. As far as I know that's how we're going to keep going for the next bit. Just because we're not too familiar with all this technology stuff. Even I struggle off and on from technology stuff because you know technology is not really my thing all of a sudden but back in I want to say what was it back in 2013 I started playing Farming Simulator 2013. Uh, mostly with, towards the end of it, but I did put a few hours in it. And then basically, then I got 15 when it came out. So I got a good thousand or two in 13, and I got about probably about the same in 15. But it's just. And then 17, I have somewhere around 2,400, 500. So I got a fair chunk in that one. So, I guess I'll, uh, we might talk to you guys when we get this field done, but we've done lots of corn picking in 17, and there'll be lots more to come. So, we're just going to go ham on this cornfield. So, I will talk to you guys when we're wrapping this cornfield up. We're basically going to be hiring workers off and on, mostly through that, and then sit in the grain cart, or else we'll go mess with bales and stuff while we're waiting on that, what we were doing earlier. Or just sit above and watch the thing go on, so... Sit back, grab yourself some popcorn, and we'll talk to you guys when we get this field basically done. You and I, we're trouble in sight. Beating hearts don't lie. An empty page, a story to write I'm in love, you're divine And it's all in our signs We're going away Get your back, check the tag Decision is made Lock your door, need no more It's already paid Cancel your mail for a while It's a journey
about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know About to see the world in action What we can be, life with no distractions We'll get away, this is what we waited for About to leave 
already packing Come with me, I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know About to see the world in action What we can be, life with no distractions We'll get away, this is what we waited for guys we are just basically finishing up there goes the train i went around the block just for the sake of it, a little fun thought it wouldn't hurt to have a little fun here what's our percent on this mission done i just want to have a little quick uh where is it under this one 80 percent so we're gonna pull up our map here and i wonder if this will work so it shows Basically, there's two spots there. I think they'll buff out. But we'll back up and get them. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that bit of a time lapse and the music and everything. Let me know if you did. That's it. Really, we didn't need to bring the green carpet. I didn't think we were that far and we'd get her all. I wasn't paying that much attention. So, let's throw these lights on. Rotor beacons. And let's run her down the road. We're just going to go down around here to the truck where we went with the first time with the 8R. There comes a car. We're going to take that sign out. Better not go over there. Better watch out to drive here. Hopefully we can drive good. We're just going to go around here slow for the first little bit. Alright, now we're cruising her. Ooh. Ooh. Get her up on that guardrail, I guess. Wasn't the best option, but nothing else I can really do. Kind of sucks. Because there's no other way around it when you get on a guardrail. The cars don't know enough to stay back or get over. Or 
That's one thing I wish Giants would have fixed for us, but... Put our turn signal on. We don't need turn signal now. We're going to whip this bad boy up. Throw this pipe out. Settle down. I think the front hopper was full, I thought we said so. Yeah. We're gonna let this guy unload. Put the pipe in on this guy. And then we should probably just end up turning the combine. We'll leave this guy sitting right there. Where is our grain supposed to go? Way down there. Let's go do some trucking. So, for the last little bit, we'll just listen to this. We'll get this guy over there. Let's turn on some lights. Let's light her up. So, let's get this guy over there, and I will talk to you guys. I might do a little bit of a last little music clip I'm not sure yet but I'll see how things go but we're just gonna get this semi over to the green elevator if I don't have to do a time lapse or anything I will talk to you guys when we get over there if not then just thanks for watching please like subscribe and don't forget to rate this video share it with family and friends and we'll see you next time thanks for all watching if I don't talk to you guys then. We're just going to keep her going like this instead. You know? It isn't going to take that long. I forgot somebody's go so fast. Uh-oh. Went the wrong way, too. Shucks. Or did we? Can't control the semi. Can't control it, guys. I don't know where we're going. I'm using the sun. <laughs> nah, I'm just messing with you guys. I don't know where this trail leads us to. Get on your own side of the road. Uh oh. Oh, the, they actually honk at you. Hey, he couldn't get over. That's his problem. Ah, oh, quit your honking. Chill out. Jeez, must have driving the stinking grass. I guess we're driving up along the beach. We're way past the train station. I guess we're going exploring the map. <laughs> There ought to be a ramp up here somewhere. Yep. I think that was more of a dead end road. We're losing power. Oh, I thought he was coming over here. He's like, hey. We're going that one. Nobody's coming. Let's buy her up. Put this bad boy in there. Uh, I'm quite sure this is the place. Triggers up over there. All right, I always thought we had to go down here to sell it, but you know, we're gonna try this way. Hope for the best. I thought it was right on the uh, train tracks.
or the rail track, railroad tracks, whatever you guys like calling them. I always thought it was on the tracks up here. Yeah, right there. So we could have went the other way too. Hopefully no train comes running through here. Because that would suck. So we're just going to... I'll get this guy unloaded here. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Don't forget to turn on post notifications. Share with the family and friends. 